Hello everyone, I hope that uh, you have a great day today. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you okay, how to find uh, the path okay, to a file. Okay, for example, in your okay, uh, file explorer, okay, and then uh, you might be able to okay, uh, look at the file okay, uh, uh, inside your file explorer, but then you don't know where is the path. Okay, so assume that uh, I'm Okay, I can uh, uh, look at my file here, mp okay, underscore wt underscore port is two dot doc. And I, okay, I know that it shows over the quick access here, but where it is located. Okay, so the way to find it out is select the file and then right click the mouse button on the pop up menu, okay, pick uh, properties, okay, pick properties. And then you can see that okay, over the uh, location here, okay, it shows that uh, the file okay, uh, is stored under C drive, okay, users, okay, and then whatever login name, okay, I'm using my son's computer. And then okay, uh, the subdirectory, okay, documents, and then I put my uh, subdirectory name over there, okay, MSU, okay, so, that is the path, okay, that is the path okay, of the file. So again, okay, uh, select the file, let me try another one, okay, select this one, right click the mouse button and pick a uh, properties, okay, pick properties, uh, look at the uh, information under the location. Okay, so this is the uh, path, okay, and then again, you can uh, write it down okay, if you want to, okay? So once okay, you have located that one, then assume that uh, you have logged into your Blackboard account, you are done with the homework, okay, and then you want to submit it. Then you can click, for example, uh, WordPress, okay, homework, okay, and then okay, uh, scroll it down, okay, and then look for the browse my computer, okay, browse my computer. And then okay, uh, again, okay, uh, it shows that uh, this computer, so it might be a little bit confusing, okay, it's okay. okay. You can either click uh, documents here directly, okay, directly, and then see that okay, that is my uh, subdirectory name, and then select the file you want to submit. Okay, so you can click open, okay, so okay, this is one, or you can use another approach, okay, so click browse my computer, okay, and then go to C drive, okay, the one, okay, uh, the path, okay, you have uh, written down, okay, so C drive, okay, so again, over here, and then go to the uh, users, okay, so scroll it up, okay, oh yeah, sorry, it's here, okay, users, okay, and then among the users, okay, I'm going to pick my son's get directory, okay, because that is the file where I stored under uh, his uh, account, okay, so MSU, uh, sorry, uh, Bertram Su, okay. Then, okay, uh, you might be able to see, okay, uh, the uh, documents, okay, so you have to move it up a little bit, okay, until you see the uh, link here, documents, okay, so double click on it, then there you go, okay, so this is the last, last subdirectory, okay, so select that one, there you go, okay, so this is my file. Okay, so assume that I want to submit another one. Okay, then I can click okay. Then you can see that uh, both files are selected. Then you can go to click the submit button. Okay, then uh, the file okay, will be submitted. Okay, I'm the instructor. Okay, so that's why you see this okay, uh, submission from preview the assignment is not saved. But for you as a student, okay, you should be able to uh, show that, that the file has been uploaded successfully. All right, okay, so uh, let me get, stop the video here. In the meantime, uh, how to get to this okay, file explorer, if you don't know how to do it, uh, you can use the uh, combination key, okay, combination key, just press the window and then uh, E, okay, a letter E key, okay, then it will show you the uh, uh, file Explorer, okay? All right, okay, I hope that uh, this will be uh, uh, useful to you, okay? So let me stop the video right now, okay? Yeah.